Easy Aquarium Maintenance. Is there even such a thing? Yes, there is. There is one type of maintenance that you only need to do once a month. This one thing will improve your aquarium's look by 90% and support the balance of the whole ecosystem. Today, I'll show you how to do it. This aquarium is two months old and you might see what the problem is. I trimmed the stem plants one time after I built it and it's been more than a month since I did. Also, the soil has been rolling forward and covering the carpet plants. I used some filter mesh to solve that problem, but since then, the stem plants have grown so much that are not letting any light get to the bottom of the tank. So by doing a precise trimming session, I'll be able to get a full carpet and improve the way this aquarium looks by 90%. If you don't believe me, stick till the end. But before we get to that, at least someone is enjoying the overgrown tank. The first thing I want to do is add more soil to it. I'll use the soil from my oil tank. This soil has been on the water, so there's no debris in it. I hope you guys are enjoying this video. If you are, you might like other videos in the channel. So remember to like and subscribe for more weekly content just like this. Once we are done trimming, what should we do with all the cuttings? If you throw them away, you'll have to decrease fertilization to avoid algae problems. And the tank will look pretty bad for a few weeks. So, I have a better idea. Let me show you. Grab a stem, measure up to 6 or 7 inches from the end, cut it, and throw away the bottom piece. Do this with all of them. Before we move on to the next step, let's get rid of the floating leaves from all the trimming. Next step is replanting. You don't need to plant them back one by one. Instead, Put a few of them together, four or five, and replant that. And they don't need to go all the way down to the soil either. Just place them in between the old stems. They will get the nutrition they need from the water column until their roots reach the soil.
cover every little spot until all you can see is the new cuttings. Now, I don't know about you, but if I'm going to be doing a maintenance session, I like to go ahead and clean the lily pipes and the skimmer. It makes a big difference to the way your aquarium looks. Lastly, a quick water change and we're good to go. Let's see how it looks now. A proper trimming session can do wonders to your aquarium. This complete maintenance session took me about two hours, and half of that time was me just trying to film everything. So in just one hour, and only once a month, you could completely change the way your aquarium looks. That is the power of a proper trimming session. I hope you got some value from this video. Let me know in the comments if there's any specific maintenance type that you find more useful. See you all next week.